Schools have been preparing for the return of students to their classrooms for the past year. One thing they were worried about was the learning gap and students falling behind academically. But Cronkite News reporter Megan Newsham found out while students are behind in academics, they are also behind in other areas. Recent studies show the pandemic set K-12 students back four to five months in math and reading. And many teachers are finding that learning loss has also led to a setback in social skills. Teachers can prepare as much as possible. But it isn't until the students are fully in the classrooms that teachers realize areas that need extra attention. Not only the academic piece, but the, the, the social, emotional of those students and what they've missed being around their friends, being around activities. And I think the kids were fired up about coming back. They wanted to come back on campus. Amy Marinella, the social studies chair at Stapley Junior High, says many teachers were not prepared to have to reteach classroom learning behavior. Honestly, we kind of need to take a step back and let's go back to the basics of how do you behave in a classroom and how, how are you respectful to other students in the classroom. Marinella says they will work on group activities and how to learn with other students. Yeah, so you're cutting out all the definitions and all your documents. Another hill for teachers to climb is a large portion of students are still learning from home. I'd say really within the first two weeks, uh, half my classes were missing every hour. And then you pass teachers are doing double work. Marinella okay, says she works every, every weeknight so. in all weekend to keep up with both in-person and online students. Okay, they do the Boston Tea Party. So what do they do? Principal Fisher explains it's a constant learning process for everyone, teachers and students, after a year of upheaval. We're going to do this together, and that's what's probably been the, the coolest thing is that we were able to have such a great group. The students' excitement to return to the classrooms has led to behavioral issues that most teachers were not prepared for. Marinella says they will be working extra hard this year to get students back on track to learning in a group environment since they have been away from it for over a year and a half. In the Broadcast Center, Megan Newsham, Cronkite News.